Good morning, and it is a beautiful morning. It is absolutely gorgeous. Tomorrow night's supposed to be below freezing, but that's tomorrow. As you can see, I got a mini excavator, and I've been using that for about a week now. I'm about three quarters of the way done with leveling this land out. I've never used a mini excavator before, so it's kind of been interesting. Learning on it. I've used tractors and skid steers before, but never a mini excavator. But it's got it's actually working out pretty good. So the end of the property on that end is level with the road. And I've pushed all the brush down there. That's pretty ugly. I'll have to deal with that later on. And the property at that end is level with the road. I've taken all this area here down about oh, a couple of feet, two, three feet. And it's got this middle section that I'm working on. And once I get this kind of all pushed over, because every time I scrape over to this edge, I gain a little level land. And that's really been my goal. I've been digging stumps out, but they are stubborn around here. So the last, the really big ones, I'm not going to waste my time and fuel. I'm just like cut them down to as low as I can without damaging the chainsaw too much. And I'm just going to burn them out. I still have four more over here that I want to cut. It is just dulling my chain up so bad. The, uh, the bark down at the base there it has so much dirt in it. It's just chewing up the... Uh, the blade on the chainsaw and resharpening it all the time. So at some point I can only do so much with smoothing this out. I'll just have to get out here with the metal rake and a shovel and pick out all the junk and do it the old fashioned way. So I'm up to find some old footage of when I first got here and show the difference in the place. You can see down at this end, I'm pretty level with the road there. And this property has a hump in the middle of it. This is actually the top of this little ridge here. So as I'm taking this out, I'm creating more usable land over here. And all this brush on the side, yeah, it's going to bother me for a while, but I'm going to have to, I can bury some of it. The rest of it, I'm just going to have to pull down the hill and burn. I'll just leave it there to rot and let the, uh, the chipmunks and the snakes have it. If you've never rented a Mini X before, it's actually not too bad. I can say the, it didn't take me as long to get used to the, uh, the bucket as I thought it would. Using two controls to raise, lower, extend, and operate the actual bucket, the scoop, and the uh, the thumb to grab stuff. So I mean, you kind of waste a day of just getting used to it, but once you get used to it, you know, it does the job. It's just really slow. This is a small one, so it really, you just got to have the patience and just, all this has been done so far with just scraping, you know, two inches at a time. So let's get back at it.
I think I've gotten to the uh, the end. I think I've cleared enough land here, leveled out enough. It's uh, going to work for me. I got about 340 feet by about 60 or 70 feet wide. That's a lot more than most people around here actually have for usable land just because it's so hilly. And I've also hit my limit on my abilities to uh, use this thing and make it any better. And the mini excavator itself is kind of it's pushing its limits to do what I've been doing with it. And the further out it gets to the side, I mean, I can only scrape about an inch off at a time. And the further I'm trying to push it, the uh, more it spills off to the side. And I go back and make two more passes to clean that up. So I think it's about it. I mean, someone with more skills could definitely smooth it out better. But it's nothing that I can't just take a rake and smooth things out and pick up the stones and whatever else I find. Hey, let me give you a, uh, a look over the top. Well, that's going to be it for today. Next step is going to be getting the garden in. My seedlings took a pretty bad hit on the uh, deep freeze the other night. They're not doing so good. So I'm hoping that's going to come around. But I'm going to get a little garden started. 